well, Sandy decided we should expand on that a little bit. And with cruise planners and out and about luxury travel, we're working on a uh, traveling golfer television show from the island of St. Lucia. It's so beautiful in St. Lucia, Tony. Really? Oh my goodness, you will love it. A pretty island. I've seen pictures. It looks beautiful. I've been all around the Caribbean, but I have not been to St. Lucia. It's just like Hawaii. Wow. Only a lot closer. And that is just really a prelude to your plans to try and do some accompanied golf trips so that our Golf Talk Live listeners could jump on board with Out and About Luxury Travel and our Golf Talk Live staff and, and go to some of these different places. What is in that blonde head of yours? What do you have going around to try and figure out uh, uh, for a trip? Well, my thought is I definitely want to have the traveling golfer at a sandals resort. Five-star global dining, and they offer free green fees for my guests. Uh, that's something I was reading about. I've never been to a sandals. I've talked to people who have been there, and they say they have so much fun there. But I've been to other Caribbean places that are really fun, too. But at this particular place, you can play golf till you drop dead. Not only golf. I mean, we love our golf. <laughs> but... There's more inclusions than any other all-inclusive on the planet. Really? You want to scuba dive? It's free. Wow. And they have Newton dive boots with the bathrooms. They're just more accommodating. Everything is just above and beyond with the Sandals Resorts. And they're dotted all over the Caribbean. I know they are all over, and they have good golf courses. Now, in St. Lucia, they have... Two different resorts. Just two. Right. Yes, Kappa States and one right at the resort at La Talk. So you just walk through the spa and onto the greens. <laughs> that's awesome. That is really uh, awesome. And that sounds like a, a great thing. And our, our Golf Talk listeners, I think, would, would really love that. As I said, we've done golf and basketball, golf and baseball. We've done Ryder Cup style competitions. I would think it's sandals with the all inclusive portion of it and all the drinks would be flowing. Non-competitive Premium drinks. Premium, Premium drinks. Premium drinks. drinks. Not non-competitive, it would be much more of a just go and play and have a good time type thing. Absolutely. And your transfers are included from the airport and to the golf course. Wow, that is really nice. Uh, you know, that, that sounds like an amazing place. And like like I say, I've been all over the Caribbean, but I have not been to St. Lucia. Uh, the pictures from it are amazing. For the listeners who don't know, tell us a little bit about exactly where it is. Well, St. Lucia is, first of all, below the hurricane line. So you rarely get that bad weather. Really? And it's a great place to go in the middle of the winter because you're pretty much guaranteed hot weather. Yeah. Where I love it, Zuma. Um, that's in the Bahamas at Emerald Bay, and that's another phenomenal golf course. And the water is, that's why they call it Emerald Bay. It, yeah. they, they see it from outer space. The astronauts have said it's the bluest water on the planet. And that is, uh, the golf course there is a, a, a Greg Norman design. Absolutely. Four signature holes. Yeah. Yeah, really amazing. Uh, now, you also threw another one out there, which <laughs> resonated with a couple of our listeners already, because I, not that I haven't talked about it on air, but I talked about it with some friends, and uh, coming off of the amazing British Open, Open Championship at Royal Portrush in Northern Ireland, you threw another name in Ireland out there and said, well, maybe we should do a an accompanied trip with Golf Talk Live at... I would do Lahinch first, but you could do even Trump. That's a nice Trump course. Turnberry. Oh, Turnberry yes. is an amazing course. It's it's good if you have Four families, months. families or um, golf groups that want to book rooms with four in one room, one one villa. That's nice. You each have your own bedroom. It's close to Lahinch. Bally, Bally Bunyan's there. Dromalin Castle has another nice course there. Well, they're both on my list because I want to go back to them because I have been to Ireland twice, two different trips, brought large groups of uh, players to both of them, I think 32 the one time and 28 the other, and 
each trip, we had great weather through the whole trip, except one day on each trip. The first time, the one day where it was sideways rain and wind, and we had to play, was at Lahinch. Oh. <laughs> The second trip, the only time we had weather that wasn't great, was at Turnberry, and I swear to God, we had all four seasons in one round of golf. It was unbelievable. It was you know, a little bit warm and sort of partly sunny when we started, and it started going downhill from there. And I remember we played on the um, last hole. It was blowing 30 miles an hour. The rain was putting holes in your face it felt like and I was playing a match against a, a guy another single digit handicap player and we halved the hole with 11s we each had an 11 and they guess what they were good 11s <laughs> in that kind of weather so I want to get back to both those places in warmer weather yeah in warmer weather and uh, obviously the way to do that folks is uh, with an expert. They take all of the anxiety out of We arrange everything. Driving. Your private driver picks you right up at the airport, arranges all your tea times, gives you a little tour if you want it. We cater it to what our clients mm -hmm. want. All right, that's Sandy Nesky from Cruise Planners Out and About Luxury Travel. Check out all of them. They have the offer at outandaboutluxurytravel.com. Sandy Nesky, she will take you anywhere in the world. Thank you, Tony. Thanks for being with us, Sandy. Oh, my gosh, this hour flew by here on the deck at Morgan Hill.